everybody, I'm back with another winter winter disco LOL surprise OMG doll. And this particular one is Dolly, and she also comes with Dollface. Um, the package becomes a playset. There's 25 surprises. Uh, are you looking for an ultra rare surprise? We know that the ultra ultra rare surprise is the um, snow powder. We found one already in our first unboxing. Didn't even know it. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and take a look at this. It says, hey, sis. This must be doll, doll face right here. And then on the back, it shows silhouettes of the four girls from this series. We've unboxed all of them. Well, we're about to unbox Dolly. Uh, the only one we haven't unboxed yet after this video is 24K DJ, which I haven't found in stores yet. Uh, let's see. Let's take a look at the side of this. I think all the boxes are the same color in this series, but I'm, I could be wrong. Uh, hmm. I think they're all a little bit different. Yeah, they're all di they're all a little different, but the design of them are the same. You have this uh this fluffy handle here, and you have the geometric like icy type crystal shapes that are all over the box, and then you have the silhouette over here. The way you open this box up, but I know I've already explained it before, but I'll explain it again. You take the tape off the side here, and this center little strap thing comes off. And then we're going to slide off the silhouette here. Okay, get it off here. Oh my goodness, she's so pretty. I will admit I haven't seen a full unboxing of her yet. Now, um, before I open this up, make that mistake again. I'm going to put her to the set, spin this around here, and we're going to read this. It says Dolly. In. Faux fur. Animal prints. Matching everything. And being bold. Out. Casual Fridays. Drama and flip-flops. Flip-flops are out? Hmm. Anyhow, and the way to open this up, and there should be a little thing here where it says pull here. Pull that open. And here is Dolly. And she's saying dress me in her dressing room. Ooh, guys. She's got that whole, uh, it's almost like this is what Cruella used to look like when she was younger. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Got this uh, BB decor thing we're going to open up first. I have no idea what's inside here. Probably something that's going to be hard to put on. Oh, it's a purse. Okay. A very simple purse. Oh, um, so it's black. The little buckle on the front of it, where it says BB, kind of backwards, because it's very designer looking. That is painted metallic gold, and then the chain is black, and it has metallic gold going all through it every other. Almost like it's a chain that's going through it. Pretty cool. The opening in the back, I'm going to go ahead and assume, is for a cell phone. I don't know if they come with cell phones or not, but it's one of those cell phone type purses. Well, let's get her out of her box here. Here's the background. Uh, the mirrors for this series are not actual mirrors. They're there. They're the background, but... Okay. So let's go ahead and open our girl up here. So, inside our box we have the LOL OMG official brush in kind of a metallic-y medium pink. You can see the sparkles in there. That's, not, that's why I'm calling it metallic-y. And then you can also see the sparkles in this uh, part of the stand. And then you have this part of the stand and then that part of the stand. So if you want to make them sit. The sitting part really still doesn't make sense to me. Especially with the way their, their knees click. But uh, to each their own. So let's grab out Dolly and we'll take a look at her. She's really gorgeous, guys. Alright, where do I start? Her hair is two-tone, as you can tell. It splits right in the middle. Uh, it's white on one side. 
or I guess you want to say platinum blonde, but I think it's more white. And then it's completely jet black on the other side. It's very shiny. Uh, super, not, not curly, I'd say wavy. And it, there's no product in it. I think the only product we... No, oh, we don't even have product in the bags. I thought there was going to be product there, but it's not there. It's all super soft. Uh, we have a little bit of a, uh, a top... Uh, a top side pony over there. and Oh, on both sides. Okay. So we have ponies on both sides. This one's weird. It's like pulled in the front and then pulled in the back. I'll have to figure that one out. Anyhow, she has black straight eyebrows. Her eyeshadow is a... Uh, somewhere between light and medium colored blue sparkly eyeshadow. And then we have the dark brown eyes with a sparkly pink lipstick. She has like a crisscross bathing suit type of outfit on. Uh, holder top crisscross. But you can see this is an actual name of this. This there's a there's a name of that print, but I'm not sure what it is. But it's black and white. I, I want to say gingham, but I could be wrong. And then just uh, plain white on the other side. The, the fabric is a really soft fabric. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's polyester, but it's super soft. These tights, let me tell you, they remind me of Gem and the Holograms for some reason. Uh, but they are fish nets. If you look really really close. They are a sparkling pink fish that type tight, and it actually has the seams. So um, that is very awesome to me. You almost want to believe they're inside out, <laughs> but that's just the way the seam is. Uh, for articulation, same as same as always with the LOLs, the heads go back and forth and up and down a little bit. Um, there is articulation on the shoulders that go back and forth. Uh, the elbows and the wrist joint, if I can get a good close-up of the nails, they are this really nice pink color, and they're long and beautiful. Uh, her waist does not move or swivel, but uh, she does have a little bit of give in her hip joints that go that way, and then they go, then you can make her sit or stand, and then she has the click joints. In her knee. So, now that all that's been talked about. Oh, I forgot to tell you, She, if you guys can see that, she's got a little bit of a mole right there on her cheek by her eye on that side. Not on that one. So let's go ahead and check out our other side here. So let's see here. We did not get any of the limit edition. Oh, what is it? Yeah, we didn't get any snow this time. We got it from the first one, so we can be happy that we found one. Okay. So let's take all this out here. And then it seems like, which is actually really cool, the plant, it's always the majesty palm there, but uh, the background of this one is different. We have like a little glowing Christmas tree, a little Polaroid camera on a shelf. We have a... A neon light here, uh, fluorescent light in pink that's kind of glowing down on it. And then we have a little vase up here with like a, I don't know, some sort of palm cutting. So that's cool. So there is a little bit of decoration in the backgrounds. Here's our little uh, instruction booklet on how to put the stand together and how to make the snow if you got it. Uh, yeah, let's get our stuff open. I'm going to spread it out here and we'll take a look. So here is Dollface. Um, our smaller LOL surprise. I think that those come out somehow. So you can check out her eyes. Same brown eyes, just like her bigger sister. And here is her uh, water bottle. So we'll put her aside. She actually is pretty cool. Okay. Now, let's see. Let's open up the hat box first. 
a lot going on in this hat box, I think. Okay, let's see what we have in here. We have, I think, some arm warmers. I don't know if these go on the hands or not, but it looks like these are arm warmers. Um, earmuffs. Which are pink, and they're fuzzy on the outside. But on the inside, they're just like plastic bowl type thing. And then, so you have, they're pink, and then these are a different type of pink. And then all around them, they have like these um, pearl-colored divots. Is that what you want to call them? Here's a cell phone. Okay. We got this. What does the cell phone say on it? VIP, orchestra, B orchestra. I'm going to have to check. This. I actually think... If I can get that to focus. I actually think that, like, there's, like, an orchestra... Like, stage on there. So I th maybe she was got tickets to go see the orchestra. Oh, wait, it says Lady Diva on there. You guys see that? If I can get that to focus. What focus? So maybe she's going to see Lady Diva? I guess maybe Lady Diva is a singer. Oh, she's some kind of... Yeah, she is a singer. Anyhow, let's, let's just move on here. So... And then we have this belt here, which I'm sure is going to be a pain in the butt belt, just like all the other ones have been. Uh, it's all black, and then it has a lot of gold detail. We have the gold chain wrapped around over here. We got the BB symbol in the middle of the belt, and then... The chain kind of wraps over here and then comes down. Is that a watch? Uh, I think it's just a little dangle. Like a little like medallion type thing. But anyhow. Got that. And then we have some sunglasses. Which might be transparent. They're pretty dark. But if you look really close you can see that... um. There's stars in there, almost stars. I was calling it a uh, a gingham type uh, pattern, so you can see that in there. But they're all black. And then, really, really small, we have these pearl stud earrings here. But the pearls being held on to with a a faux twenty four carat uh, earring prong, so you can see that the prong itself is painted metallic gold to make it look like it's gold. Um, so let's move on to our next thing here. We have our shoes, which is in a black box with that geometric um, ice texture here. Ooh, it's not just black. If you guys look at that close up, I don't know if it's going to work, if it's going to show up. But there is lots of blue sparkles embedded in that. Dark blue. Really, really pretty. Okay. So does it say in here what kind of shoes these are supposed to be? Pink feather? Pink pleather. Okay, so they're probably going to be some kind of pink shoes. I'll admit I have not seen a full review of this doll yet. I like to wait to see other people's reviews until after I do my own. These are pretty cool. So we have a uh, pink silhouettes. I don't really know. They're kind of a Mary Jane style type of heel, and the the little clasps on them are painted in metallic silver. So that's they're really kind of a simple shoe for these type of dolls. But you can see the seam on the, the seams actually on there. There's so much detail. In this plain shoe. So there's two of them. And then we have this first bag. Which has some zebra print on it. Two different types of zebra print. Or stripes. Zebra stripes. What is it like a zebra stripe and then maybe a white tiger stripe? And then the dark pink. Done in checkers. And ooh, what is this? 
on a black hanger, whatever it is. I think it's a skirt. Yeah, this is some kind of skirt, guys. It's all black. And it's black sparkly. And then on top of it has like a, a faux fur uh, type lining. So that should be interesting. That'll go awesome with our belt. Okay, what else do we have here? This is going to be our last surprise. And this, oh, this is a skirt. That must be, that must be, oh, okay. It might be one of those shawl wraps, I think. Oh, yeah, it's probably this thing right here that I was looking at. And this is the skirt. And they match, so. You guys can see you got that black and white gingham on that side, the plain white, and then we have a black faux fur that go around the bottom. And this is on a pink hanger with sparkles embedded in that, so. Um, yeah, and it's uh, also animal print for the bag itself, the black and white. So let's go ahead and get all this stuff put on her, and we'll check her out. All right, guys, here she is all made up. <laughs> I guess I have to say OMG. She is beautiful. She is a stunning addition to my OMG doll collection. A couple of things here. I love these this, these uh, earmuffs on her. I don't like the glasses on her uh, for the particular reason uh, that the other ones, you can't see her eyes and the eyes are, you know, part of the beauty of these dolls. The only ones that so far that I was able to have a liking to the glasses uh, was our last girl. Uh, anyhow, so the earrings are on underneath here. You can just see that here. There's the earrings. They're very simple pearl earrings that we looked at earlier. And it's nice because they fit underneath this, but if you ever want to take those earmuffs off, you have something else to look at under there. That's brilliant. Brilliant designing on their at their end. I also forgot to show you that this girl has a different type of hand than the other ones. Uh, I think she's the first one that we have seen that has a ring. Let's see if I can get the focus good. Because this ring is... Uh, there we go. The ring is actually, um, it's gold. It has a pink heart, but it's a gold sword that's going through the pink heart. Uh, it's kind of a classic tattoo design there. Um, also, <laughs> the belt was a lot easier to put on than any of the other belts uh, from this series so far. Um, the, the things that were hard to put in, the earrings were really tight to get in. But once you got them in, they were pretty good. These were a son of a gun to get on. These were the first hard shoes to get on. And I think it had something to do with the tights being a little bit... Uh, they're tight to her skin, but they're a little slippery. And then with the seam on top of it, it makes it even worse. But once they're on her, look how gorgeous those shoes are with, that, with the seams on that... I don't even know what to say. <laughs> oh, and also we have put our her cell phone. It fits in there nice and taunt in the... Uh, Cell phone purse bag holder. <laughs> but yeah, um, this is all we have for you guys today. Uh, if you like this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.